crowds of the season and the large Newcastle contingent had to suffer early on as Nick Pickering went close to scoring for Coventry. David Speedy was in inspired form and Peter Jackson had to be alert to prevent him from heading Coventry into the lead. But it was Newcastle who took the lead with a stunning goal from Paul Goddard after good work by Merendina and Gascoigne. Sadly, the euphoria was short-lived as Cyril Regis scored the goal of the match after the Newcastle defence failed to clear. Back came United and Agrizovic in the Coventry goal worked wonders to keep out this Darren Jackson shot. Morandini's pace was causing Coventry all sorts of problems and it created United's second goal scored by Gascoigne. It was Gascoigne who began to run the show from midfield in the second half and he started off a wonderful four-man move which ended in this goal from Darren Jackson. Three one, and it was nearly four as a Grizovic only just managed to palm away this effort from Mirandinha. So Newcastle's impressive away form continues. The three points take them into a mid-table position, and they've now gone four league games without defeat. But it wasn't complete joy for United manager Willie McFall. United star striker Mirandinha had to leave the field with a pulled hamstring. Well, today, the Brazilian spent the morning on the treatment table. And though the injury means he's certain to miss some games, it's not as bad as it might have been. Is your leg sore? <laughs> One thing to his advantage is that he's normally mobile, fairly supple. So hopefully he should heal a little bit quicker than normal. But out for a couple of weeks, nevertheless? Um, possibly, yeah. yeah. And is it going to require intensive treatment from you, then? Yes, he'll have... Treatment every day, Saturdays and Sundays as well. How do you feel? My leg no, no very good. <laughs> no, no, no very good.